Hello! Um, so I had a bit of a self-tan uh, fail, not a big one but a little one uh, when I used my self-tan um, products for the first time. Um, the first couple of hours it looked absolutely fantastic and then I went to bed and then overnight it kind of developed even more and I looked like, um, if you're from the UK then you'll know uh, David Dickinson uh, cheapest chips um, and certain parts especially my, my hands back of my hands uh, I looked very very orange and I was going away that weekend so I quickly ran out um, to Superdrug and bought um, this here which I don't know if you can see it there you go it's uh, Bondi Sands um, self tan eraser and I was doing some research and a lot of people recommended to use this as well as lots of other things like um, use lemon and uh, sugar and put through that and that will dissolve it. Uh, others were go and take a swim in a swimming pool because the chlorine will take some of it off. Um, I can't remember what the other one was. Oh, baking soda, uh, sorry, baking powder and water foam it up like a paste and then that'll come off. Um, so I did actually try two of those, which was, because uh, I didn't have enough time to go out to a swimming pool, but, so I tried the baking soda and I tried the um, lemon and sugar, but I didn't have any lemon, so I tried lime instead, because I, I thought the citrusy stuff would work. Um, actually, both of those things did work a little bit, but when I say a little bit, it was, it was noticeable, but not, not really that great. Uh, so the next morning, like I say, I went off to Superdrug, bought Bondi, uh, Bondi Sands um, eraser and used that and I left it on for about 30 minutes. Um, it did calm down the hands. Um, you could still tell that there was fake tan on there but um, it does say that it's best after three days rather than probably what was less than kind of like 12 hours. Um, so yeah and it also mentions about leaving it on for five days um, and then, um, sorry, leaving it on for five minutes, not five days, leaving it on for five minutes and then, um, taking it off. Um, but I left it, uh, well, what did I do it? Friday, it's now Tuesday. Um, I left it on for 45 minutes and when I got in the shower, I could just see all of the tan kind of, you know, uh, going down the plug hole basically and it just started to kind of sweep off of me um, I did have a bit of a uh, like a exfoliating brush thing that I kind of did the major areas and uh, you know, back of the knees, knees and um, hands, elbows that type of thing just to kind of really help it and then I just gave myself a quick once over um, but I have to say, absolutely fantastic. This really did work. Um, I think, like I say, it's best after three days, as it says. Uh, it's probably best after half an hour, 45 minutes, rather than five minutes. Um, but did it do what it said it was going to do? Yeah, it did. And it wasn't that bad. It actually smelled quite nice as well. So that's my review. I think it is fab. I will definitely be using this again. Um, hopefully, though, I won't have too many hiccups again in the future but if I do I know exactly where to go uh, for this um so yeah have a good day wherever you are bye bye